Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. So today the girls and I are just hanging out at the house. I am finishing up on my PCOS and infertility video, which is so hard for me to post y'all. By the time y'all see this video, you'll already see that video, but yeah, I just want y'all to know that that was really, really hard for me. Um, it's, it's so aggravating because we have horrible like internet service here. So it takes me like a full day to get a video uploaded. So I don't know what I'm going to do about that. So it's hard for me to stay like consistent with my videos. Um, so yeah, I, I need to figure that out. But that's what we're doing today. The girls are playing in their room and I wanted to show y'all a couple things. I got them this past weekend when my mom and I went shopping. Um, I got myself a couple things. I only found like two outfits and a, sh a cute little shirt um, because it's so hard for me to find clothes that fit me right since I'm like so petite. Um, but I was going to do like a little try on in a little bit, um, to show y'all some of the things that I got because they are super cute. But this is what I got the girls and Charlie, sit, Baker is too, Baker's already had a princess dress, but Charlie is completely obsessed with this little Elsa dress that I got her. Um, so yeah, I'll show y'all. So this is the dress I got. Harley. It's this cute little Elsa dress. It's actually a little nightgown, but um, yeah, it's really cute. And I got it from a place, it's kind of like TJ Maxx. I don't even remember what it was called. But yes, she looks so cute in this. I actually posted a picture of her and Baker wearing these on my Instagram. Um, and then Baker got her a bell little jammy dress. And I got this from Target. It's really cute. Guess that, mine. that is yours, huh, baby? My, my Super cute. This thing. Yes, in just a minute, let mommy show these sh these clothes real fast, okay? Um, and then I got them these little Halloween shirts from Old Navy. This one says Hey Boo, and these were on sale. I think I got them. They were regularly ten dollars, and I think I got them for. I think they were, I want to say maybe they were 50% off. This, this, this name is Hey Boo. That one's Hey Boo. And then this is the other one I got them. And they each got one of these little t-shirts. Um, but yeah, these were from Old Navy. Super cute. And then they had these shorts on sale. So they each got a pair of these little shorts. I got white and I got these cute little green ones. And, you know, since it stays so hot here in Texas, I figured, you know, I would just pair these little. Yeah, hold on. I would pair, you know, these Halloween shirts with their shorts. It's, they really can't wear, like, you know, jeans or anything. So, I got all this stuff for super cheap from Old Navy because they were having a really big sale. And then, I don't know um, if y'all have ever tried these, but Baker Grace is obsessed with this. And I got this from TJ Maxx. Um, I think you can pretty much get them anywhere. But, yeah, it was just $4 from TJ Maxx. And she absolutely loves that thing. <laughs> Uh -huh. huh but yeah that's what that's some of the stuff I got this weekend um it was a last minute trip my mom and I decided last minute you know what let's go and let's get out of the house since it had been like I said it had been like almost a year since we had done anything so we didn't really plan on where we were gonna go um I really want to go try the loft and um what is the other store called? Madewell? Is that how you say it, y'all? And I've never been to like Nordstrom or anything like that. Um, so I would love to try those stores too because I know that they have like petite clothes. Um, but it's a long ways away from where we live. So we really need to like plan that out um, and go do that one day. But the clothes that I got that I'm going to show y'all here in a little bit, I got them from Abercrombie. But y'all, we went to so many different stores and I tried on so many different outfits and that was all I could find that would fit me. So, yeah, I'm going to show y'all those here in a little bit. Hi. 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 What are you doing? What are you doing? So, 
first I want to say that I'm sorry about my mirror. <laughs> I went and I found a mirror that I loved. Um, it was super cheap. It was from Bed Bath & Beyond. Um, and then I told my mom, I was like, you know what, let's go look at World Market. And if I don't find anything there, then we'll come back and get this one. And we completely forgot to go back and get the other mirror. So this is what I'm working with today. Um, so anyways, this is the outfit. This is my favorite outfit that I got. Um, it's not something that I usually wear. Um, I've never been super comfortable with wearing anything like this, but my mom talked me into it. So it's like, whatever, I'll get it. Um, it's super cute. I love the skirt. I love the little slit. Um, I don't think I would pair these shoes with it. This is just what I had to kind of show y'all. Um, love the top. And then I'll get a little bit closer so y'all can see the kind of material that it's made out of. They also had a, it was like a green color. It wasn't, I didn't really care for it too much. I liked the black better. Um, so yeah, this is it. I love it. Super cute. It's not super tight fitting. Um, it's very comfy. Super comfy. But yeah, I love, love this one. Definitely my favorite that I got. This is the other outfit that I got. And hold on, y'all. There we go. Um, as you can see, I really like black. This is black. Um, I don't know if you can tell in the camera, but I love how it has little pockets on it. I, I've always wanted a dress like this, but I can never find one that fits me right. They're always like super big up here. Um, this one is an extra small, so it fits perfect. It's, it's not too short. It's not too long. It's perfect length. Doesn't make me look frumpy. Um, but yeah, and it actually looks super cute paired with these shoes. I got this from, like I said, I got all of it from Abercrombie. But I'll get a little bit closer so y'all can see the material. It's very good material too. It's not super thick. It's not super thin. Perfect. But I figured this would be cute to wear like when we go and take the girls to do some, you know, to like the pumpkin patch or just stuff like that. It's not too dressy. Um, and it's still really cute. So, yeah, I really, really like this one, too, y'all. I like everything I got. Um, but, yeah, like I said, this was from Abercrombie. And I will try and link everything below for y'all. Okay, y'all, so this is the last thing I had to show y'all. This super cute little shirt. And I was not going to get this. Um... Let me move my blind out of the way and my curtain out of the way. I wasn't going to get this shirt because it was very expensive. And it's just hard for me to spend this much money on clothes. But my mom talked me into it because I don't have anything like this. Um, it's super cute though. All the little the lace. It's very good quality too. And the back of it. Um, and these jeans. I got these jeans last year from Hollister. They are actually like jeggings, um, but they're really comfy. They don't have pockets. Super comfy, super stretchy. Uh, yeah, I love these jeans. Yeah, they don't have pockets. They're fake. <laughs> but yeah, uh, I have a hard time finding clothes, and it's funny. That's why I go to like Abercrombie and Hollister because... Those are the only clothes that fit me. So, they have really cute things, too. I wasn't too impressed with Hollister this past time. Um, but, yeah, I did find some cute stuff from Abercrombie. But I need to find a dress for a wedding that we have coming up next month, the end of next month. So, let me know down in the comments if y'all know of any places that have petite I prefer affordable clothes, but I mean, I know it's okay to splurge every once in a while. Um, I don't like to shop online because I don't like to get my clothes and them not fit and have to send them back. Um, but if you know some shops that have petite clothes, then I wouldn't mind trying them. Um, so, <laughs> both the girls are sitting here eating snacks. So, yeah, um, just let me know down in the comments if what y'all's favorite stores are Hi. and, um, Hi. yeah. Hi. <laughs> Hi. Hi. 
Y'all are so cute. I did a video. 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 What is your daddy gonna do when we all go shopping together? What's he gonna do? Go work. He's gonna go to work. You say night night. Charlie. <laughs> I'm not saying that night. Your blanket and peaches are in here. Okay, say that night. Say that night. You say night night? No night. Night night. Hold on to my camera, baby. Don't drop it. Okay. Don't y'all. Mama put a child in night night. Oh, why? <sighs> because I always go night night. I go tell her. So, I walk into my mom. So, I'm coming back. Anyway. So, mom just said, all my pocket cookies. Uh oh. And all my cupcakes. My pink cupcake, my blue cupcakes, for my brothers. And my and Amy. And all my plants. <laughs> yeah, all my plants. But all my plants like my cupcakes. And I mean, they never tried them. <laughs> my eyes are watered. They clap it up. <laughs> I wanted to show y'all my stationary bike that I used. I don't think I've ever showed it on my channel before. Um, I know I've linked it, but this is it, and there's not much to it. But um, yeah, it was just, what are you doing? You're silly. It was just a little over $100. Um, I did get a little cover. <laughs> You're silly. For the seat, because the seat's super hard, and this is still pretty hard. So sometimes I put a blanket, like that red blanket, is what I usually use, um, to sit on and ride it. But um, yeah, this thing, like I said, it was super cheap, folds up, super small. Here, I'll show y'all, so y'all can kind of see what I'm talking about. Okay, so it's folded up now. It's like super small, and I just shove it in. My front closet and when I'm not using it that's where it goes but yeah I'm fixing to work out I'm gonna ride this thing today because um, I need to catch up on some of my YouTube videos my YouTube moms that I watch so I am fixing to do that now while Baker Grace what are you gonna do when mommy works out um, just lay down <laughs> and Charlie Faith is napping right now so yeah that's what we're about to do I just got done working out and um, I'm drinking my protein. I also just got off the phone with, um, my hair really bothers me sometimes. Uh, I had it up a minute ago. So I just got off the phone with my nurse from my um, natural doctor because I got some blood work done, mm, I think it was like a week ago. Um, I got my blood work done for my thyroid and they checked a couple other things um so i got those results back and they weren't great um my thyroid is going back up to being hyper again it like it was good for a while um but it bounces back and forth like it goes between hypo and hyper and they said that's from my um autoimmune disease that it makes it do that I don't know um, but she said it could also be because like I mentioned in my PCOS video um, that I bleed all the time like when I say I bleed all the time y'all I mean I do like a lot of people don't believe me but I do um, and it sucks so she said it could be because my iron is very low they um, they checked that too and she said it's super low so she said that my iron could be affecting my thyroid um so i asked her uh you know this was just my nurse i asked her what she thought about us 
you know, about having another baby, getting pregnant, and if that was okay to get pregnant when, excuse me, when my thyroid's like that. And she's like, well, no, you know, we don't really recommend that because we want you to be as healthy as you can be. Um, so she said that, you know, I have my doctor's appointment with my natural doctor um, in like two weeks. So I'm going to talk to her about it and see what she thinks. Um, I don't know. She said, my nurse said that we're just going to keep like adjusting my thyroid medication to see what happens. Um, <clears throat> but I don't know. It just sucks. It's like when you feel like things are finally going right, something like this happens, but it could be way worse. Um, I'm just thankful that I do have these doctors to help me through all this. Uh, so yeah, once I talk to my natural doctor about it, then I will go to That'll my OB if they say it's okay, and we'll get the whole process <laughs> going. So yeah, I also wanted to say too that in my PCOS video, I had mentioned that I got those ovulation tests and I do not recommend those if you have PCOS because it will give you a false positive. Um, it told me that I was fixing to ovulate for three days in a row. On that third day, I started my period. So, um, I know this is a lot of like TMI and this is really hard for me to talk about, but there's, like I've said before, there's so many women that I can help out, um, through this whole process. So I'm going to, um, so yeah, I don't recommend those at all. Um, if anything, do like a basal body, like I think they call like the basal body temperature, like take your temperature, um, I'm in Baker's room and she's playing. Take your temperature every morning right before you get out of bed, um, so you can kind of track your cycle. Uh, but yeah, don't recommend the ovulation test at all. But no, I'm going to keep y'all updated on everything like I said I would. So once I have my appointment with my natural doctor, I will let y'all know how that goes. Um, I'm just praying that everything goes well, but I'm like the type of person that I always feel like everything happens for a reason. So I know that it will all happen when it's supposed to in God's timing. So uh, yeah, that's just, just going to keep praying about it and let it happen when it's supposed to. I don't like to force stuff. Um, so yeah, hopefully <clears throat> my doctor's appointment, we can get back on... Um, I can kind of figure out what kind of medication I need to be on, the strength of it, and then we can get rolling on everything else. I forgot to show you all these earlier. These are the girls' new um, cups that I got them, or I guess you would say, I don't know if you would say cups, but anyways, these are their, we call them their juice cups, um, even though all they drink is water in them. Anyways, uh, I love them. I got them from Target, but I did find some on Amazon so I will link those below but um they are very nice they are stainless steel so I love that about them because I'm not a big fan of plastic hey, now look into my eyes you can use them as a mirror you're my ticket to paradise hey now look into my eyes you can use them as a mirror You want some broccoli? Yes. Sister, you want broccoli? <laughs> okay. Good job.
Creep man. Creep man. You go in there, man. So. Good job. Okay. You silly. Okay, yeah. So we just gave the girls a bath. We got our jammies on, brushed our teeth, and now we are getting ready to go to bed. We just sent our camper off about an hour ago, so it's crazy to finally have that thing done. But anyways, I'm gonna end the vlog here. Thank y'all so much for watching today's video. Don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up, and we will see you in our next video. Bye, y'all.